Welcome to Beer Stories from Beer Store Brewhouse. This video is about what to think of when you're buying beer. If there's one thing I really hate, it's when I spend money on beers that uh, is just ruined or not as good as they could be. Not because of the brewery and how they brewed it, but from what happened when it left the brewery to it got to some kind of uh, middleman ended out in a shop, I bought it, and then I tasted it. In that process, there can happen many things um, that you may or may not know anything about, and that can ruin the beer. Temperature and storage is a, a key thing here, I guess. If the beer is transported from uh, over a great distance, it will probably not have been cold throughout that time. So that can already make the beer a little stale. Um, but then again, uh, in the supermarket where they store the beer before it's sold, is it stored hot or cold? If it's on the shelf, how long has it been there? Um, is it in a fridge or is it just on a, on a, on a shelf? Those are really important questions you have to ask yourself. And if you can, ask the person who sells you the beer. In a supermarket, it's often not that easy. In a bottle shop, it's very easy. Or in a beer bar, it's very easy. But in a cafe or supermarket or just a small shop, it's not that easy to get this information. Um, I also look at the canning date. If it's a hobby beer, six weeks, I think it's peaking there. Um, after six weeks, the beer, the hoppy flavors will actually start to diminish. And it doesn't matter if you store it cold or it would, it would, it will, it will not happen so fast if you store it cold. But all IPAs and hoppy beers, they will get less hoppy with time. You can't stop that. Six weeks, and then it's downhill from there. So uh, look at the canning date or the best before date. IPAs are always uh, a year, I think. Most of them, I haven't seen any go for more than a year. Uh, so look at that, especially for IPAs. Pilsners, lagers uh, with a low ABV, they will be good within a year. But again, I like them more fresh than, than that. Bigger ABV beers that are not hoppy. Um, Imperial Stouts, Barley Wines, uh, Baltic Porters, uh, Quartz, stuff like that. They can tolerate temperatures and time better. Um, but yeah, but just think about these things. What can happen between it's leaving the brewery until you drink it. All that time is really, really important when you're buying beer. And of course the canning date. And then how is it stored? Uh, is it in a can? Then light is not a problem, but if it's in a bottle, uh, light will be a problem, uh, especially in green bottles or clear bottles. Is it just sitting on a shelf? Is there a sunlight on the beer? I've seen uh, wine shops and also some bottle shops actually having beer bottles in their window. That beer I will never buy because of light, because of temperature, uh, yeah, well, the temperature will go up and down and will heat up the beer. So I would never buy a beer from a window. So yeah, consider that as well. And then there's the last thing, hotels and bars where you get draft beer. If it's a beer bar, I will ask them, how often do you clean your lines? They should clean their lines every time they put on a new keg. Um, a good beer can turn bad just from leaving the keg through a dirty line and into your glass. Uh, also dirty glassware can actually produce diacetyl pretty fast, but that's not a common problem. The beer lines are the big problem. So uh, if the beer can actually go sour or get diacetyl in it uh, just by running through a short dirty beer line. So ask the person 
giving you the beer, if uh, how often they clear their beer lines. Also ask what beers are the most fresh beer, because yeah, a beer can also get boring if it's stored in, uh, in the keg for a long time because a bar, the keg is not cold. Um, so if, a, if an IPA has been sitting warm for three months, it's not good anymore. Yeah, so uh, look at the people around you in the bar. What are they drinking? Ask what they're selling most of and uh, probably pick that. If it's a beer bar, they should have, they should know about this and actually uh, be on top of it. So it shouldn't be a problem, but always ask. And I guess that was it. There's nothing worse than getting a good beer that's gone bad before you have the time to drink it. Um, so uh, be clever and buy your beer with, uh, yeah, with these things in mind. If you have any questions, you write to me in the comments or through Instagram, Facebook and so on. Um, yeah, or just have a happy brewing out there. <laughs>